Greetings, greetings on this July 2025. What we have here is the GEPRC uh, Cinelog V3 model. This is a TPS Nano RX, so it's crossfire. So before I show you what is in here, I will show you what I have had for quite some time. Here has been my only Cinewoop. This has definitely seen its age. It has the original air unit in it. And it certainly has performed well for inside uh, as long as you had enough room. And I have it mounted on the bottom here. And these are really good motors, 23, 2203s, 3000 kV. Really handle the props well. And uh, which we're uh, done a lot of designing on this, adapting so that it would fly as smooth as possible. But we are now using 04s in much better quality. Here is a, a GoPro you could put on here as well. And if anyone is interested in acquiring this perfectly good setup, uh, you are welcome to message me in the comments and we can uh, either, we can work something out. Here we are with this Cine Log unboxing. And come, oh, this is very nice. All right, removing this. Here we are with our Salon 30 v 3 Perfect. All right, this particular model does not come with the 04 air unit. As we can, as of the filming of this video, they're simply not available. Here we are, TBS Crossfire. Now, this is what's going to replace my old Cinewhoop. And this will allow me to do lots of good fly throughs for real estate purposes. Uh, this is a 4S. I have plenty of 4S batteries. And what we're going to do is install the O4 air unit in here. And this can also take an action cam. Here is what is rest of it in the box. Here you can mount your GoPro action cam. We have additional straps, antennas, extensions, uh, more props, replacement props, and we have a whole another frame here. Really good quality, it does appear to be. So we will be putting the O4 air unit in here. And which is really good quality. And I'm anxious to find out how this works. All right, greetings, greetings, ladies and gentlemen. On this 2025, we have our Cine, let's see, Cinelog 30, it's called. A beautiful little drone for inside work. We're going to fly it out here and see how it goes. Uh, this will be for my real estate work. It's the only little Cinewhoop that I have. It's the 04 air unit on here. I installed that. It's got the 700 milliamp battery on it. All right. Well, after the uh, flying to 1S, this has got a lot of power. Wow, this is nice. Wow, didn't even mind that. Didn't flutter. Oh, I didn't mind it at all. Impressive. This is flying like a a three inch without any uh, without any prop guards. As we know, Cinewhoops have a inherent aerodynamics of a of a bulldog. Just freestyle. Oh, okay. Settle it in its own prop wash. Anyway, freestyle is not what this is for, but it sure does it really well.
very nice, very smooth, very responsive. Impressive. Wow, this this is really well. I would have thought this would struggle out in the open wild. Maybe maybe on wind on a windy day, but this is windless and it's very very nice. There is no issues with this whatsoever. Very easy to control. Very nice, very nice. I love it. What a lovely cruiser this is. This is really, really nice. This, this is great, especially prop guards flying over other soft targets. Uh, this is the original tune as well. Original filters, I have not done anything with them. This is all stock as far as I remember. I haven't done anything. I put the 04 air unit on. Other than that, I believe I left everything as it was, except for, I believe even the rates are the same. Uh, but I will put on screen if I did change anything. Impressive, very, very impressive. Very, very impressive. What a lovely cruiser. Huh, this is extremely good flight time as well. This is really, really nice. Oh my goodness. Impressed. I am very... First flight of the Cinelog. Very, very pleased with it. No jello, no bobbliness, no... It's right out of the box. Really, really nice. We're on five minutes already. Just, just simply cruising around here. What a nimble little little powerhouse All right. End of our first flight. Impressive first flight of our Cinelog. 